I'm tired and thirsty. I am tired too. I just hope we can get transport to the city. The day is already half spent. I'm so sorry, Indy. Come on. Why are you sorry? I'm the one who brought this whole trouble upon us. I should be sorry, not you. Don't say that. I'm equally responsible for my own actions. I'm only angry because I didn't get enough time to inflict serious physical injuries on those Jezebels. Hmm. Would you? You really beat them. You beat them very, very well. See, I don't think they will forget that beating in a hurry. Seriously. <laughs> but those girls are evil. And they deserve to be punished. I don't even know how they manage to always escape every repercussion that should be their caution. That's life. Is it possible for a girl to lose her virginity without having sex with any man? That is quite an interesting question. Well, it's remotely possible for the hymen in a lady's reproductive organ to get perforated due to certain stress or interference. But it's not the same as losing her virginity through sex. No. So, what you're saying is, even when the, the hymen of the lady is broken, the lady can still be a virgin without sleeping with any man? Yes. You see, virginity has a deeper emotional and spiritual implication that dignifies every person, especially a young lady. That is why it's always advisable for her to keep her virginity until her wedding night. <laughs> okay. Thank you, Ma. You're welcome. And, Ndidi Amaka, I want you to feel free to ask me questions whenever you feel like. Okay? Okay, Ma. Thank you very much. You're welcome. <laughs> Okay, take Bye. care of you. All right. Sorry. Sorry, Ma. Um, please, one last question. It's okay. 
please don't be offended. Not at all. Mama, please, um, since you're not married, are you still a virgin? <laughs> I'm, I'm sorry, I'm laughing. <laughs> well, I'm no longer a virgin, and I regret it. That is why I'm asking you, begging you, to keep yours, okay? Is that all? Yes, ma'am. That's all. Thank you. Have a nice day, Didi. Okay. okay. <laughs> Could it be possible that Ndidi was actually saying the truth? Oh dear. She might be right after all. Strange things do happen nowadays. Oh God. What are we going to do from here? The night, the night will soon come, and the city street is not hospitable for two young girls to be seen at night. Where do we go from here? I don't know. I don't think I can go back home to my parents. They will be so heartbroken. Then where do you intend to go? I still don't know. My poor father sold the only land he inherited from his late father to pay my school fees. I can't just show up with this mysterious pregnancy and tell him I've been expelled from school. That will kill them. I see what you mean. I'm not going home directly either. My parents will skin me alive. I have an aunt who lives in Benin, so I will just take the night bus and go there until I figure out what to do next. You are lucky. I don't have anyone anywhere to go to. Then come with me to Benin. No, Uju. I've caused you so much pain already. Don't worry. I'll survive. How? Uju, God will see me through. I believe that. I just hope you know what you're doing. How would you survive here? Come with me. Come with me. <laughs> oh God, what kind of life is this? Why am I suffering like this? Uju was right. The street is not a friendly place for a helpless girl at night. Where am I going to sleep now? I'm so scared. Please help me, God. Help me. do for here? Ma? What do they do for my area? Huh? What do they do for here? Sorry, sorry, please. I'm only trying, I'm trying to, trying to do waiting. Uh, you, this guy, don't they look you since from there, now they look you. You are a waka up and they used to have a fight customer. You don't spread like tolo tolo when no get mama. What do they buy for my area? Madam, madam, please forgive me, please. You I'm sorry. 
That means you call madam. Well, you, 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 want, you want to make her worse, you're mad. See this old mama, me and you who's senior. You know, Chris, please forgive me, please. Shut up, please. forgive yourself. See this way, they call me madam. For a year, I'm. For a year, I'm. I go change them for you. What did I do for you? Ma, please forgive me. Please forgive me. Forgive you. I'm sorry. Forgive yourself. What did they do for you? I don't ask you before. I'm coming from a very far place. Please, I don't know anybody here. Really? I don't I don't have anywhere to sleep. Please. You are coming from a very far place. Yes. What it consign me? Big girl like you, you carry back come up from house. You know get where you they could just carry back come up like sheep. When you get shepherd, you get sense at all. What do they buy for here? Please. Please I, wait. I, I only want a place to sleep tonight. I only want a place. Just for this night. Come, 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 come like this. Ma? Come. Where you they go? Drop that bag, I beg. Ma? Drop palm. Turn around, make her see. Eh? Turn. Come like this. You try, Sha. I'm going to help you. We can just carry you, go where you go, sleep for this night for free. Thank you. Just man. this night, oh. Thank you. Don't thank me. Follow me. Madam, ah, ah. you still asleep. Why you don't reach, oh? Wake up. Wake up now. I don't say money don't reach. Good morning, ma. <clears throat> Good morning. You enjoy your sleep? Yes, ma. Thank you for allowing me sleep here. I'm grateful. No problem. Then I walk to help people with their stranded for streets. What you that your name again? Indeed, Yamaka. Indeed, Yamaka. Indeed, for short. Okay. Indeed, Yamaka. Where did they try hear me last night? Say you get belly. You don't know who give you belly. They try to tell me say you be virgin. How come? Ma. Please. It's not a fake story. But the truth. I don't know how the pregnancy came about because I've never slept with anyone before. I'm still a virgin. I beg, I beg, I beg, I beg, make a young word. Ah, ah, which kind of you virgin be that? You be virgin, now you carry belly. Eh? I don't understand. Believe me, ma, I've never slept with anyone before. I swear, I swear with my life. I don't hear, I don't hear. I don't hear. Ah, ah, I don't hear. I believe you. You know, say, strange things, they happen these days. You see this life, you don't turn upside down and finish. But to me, oh, I be want to ask you, what do you want to do? Because you know, go use this belly, walk for street. Left for me, I go say, make you. Come out down. Huh? Yes. No, 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 no. What do you know? No. See this one, because I'm the smallest one they talk to you. No. What do they worry you? They tell you something, they tell me no, no, no. That means they carry, they do body like that for. So they bring that leg. Auntie, the last time I tried an abortion, I almost died. I can't do it again. <laughs> See me, I tell you, you know, get choice. As you did like this, no man go fit squash you with this belly you carry. They hear me so. You know, go walk. So the earlier you just think I'm not, think I'm what you want to do, the better for you. Because me, I don't know what's again you want me to tell you. You see hunger, now your second name. Mm, I don't know what I will do. I have nowhere to go. And if, if my parents learn about my present condition, they will just die. <laughs> you don't do. You don't do. No cry now. See me. I don't get this kind of condition before. Yes, I don't get this kind of condition. I wouldn't carry me enter streets. I should have seen me so. I've been to go school before. Yes, I've been to go school. 
will not worry. Your condition will be different. I will help you. Don't worry. Thank you, ma. God bless you, ma. Thank you, ma. It's so insane. The kind of things that come my way every day. Every day. And then I try, I really try. I try, I really try. I try so hard to understand. So hard to understand. Maybe someday I will find a way somehow to figure it out. Figure it out. Figure it out. Lord of Jesus. But how do I explain? What happened to your faces? Good day, Miss Hunter. What Good happened day, to your faces? Ma, Ma, we were attacked by two witches. Yes. Witches? Yes. They used their witchcraft to fight both of them. Witches in this school compound? Yes. Who are they? They've been sent out and gone for good. Sent out and... You know, it takes a witch to know a witch. Ma, it's Ndidi and Duju. Those girls are truly witches. They are witches. Imagine they, they, they beat us up with their witch, witch powers. See what they did to us. Are you trying to tell me Ujumwa and Didiamaka did this to both of you? Yes, She even laughing. Does she think this is a joke? Okay, no problem. I know what to do. We'll deal with her. Is it not her in this school? Azoka, this is four months. They spared my daughter from school. And they said she ran away from school. They said, my daughter is not in the school. My daughter is not at home. Where is my daughter? Uh, brother, take it easy. We'll, they, we'll find her. We'll find her. When are we going to find her, Azoka? I cannot begin to imagine that Didi Amaka, my only daughter, is missing. When, look, I think I am taking it very easy I with don't, this. Little, no, it has not And we carry police and go there. It has not come up to that. Uh, 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 well, it depends on what he's thinking. Of. Uh, yes, the, yes. The way yes. he's thinking, taking no, it over. No, 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 don't, don't worry. I heard your voice from inside. What is the problem? It's one man that is trying to make my BP to rise. Taking laws into it. Uh, what, what of our friend, though? That, that man, I don't know what is wrong with that man. Wrong with it is man. his own BP that will rise, not your own. Yes. But, oh, God forbid. You know what is wrong with that man? <laughs> no, no, I didn't know you were here. Yeah. Yes, ma'am. You're ma welcome. Thank you. How about your family? They are fine. In fact, they are better than me. Better than you. <laughs> yes, ma'am. As well. You're welcome. Thank you, ma'am. Uh -huh. uh, you were supposed to go to Mumbi school to check on my daughter. Yes, ma'am. Have you done that? Yeah, I was there the other day yes. and uh, I saw her. Mm -hmm. Very, very fine. Very she's healthy. Fine. Very healthy. Yes, ma'am. So, fact, my daughter is healthy. Mm -hmm. In fact, she's preparing for her forthcoming exams. Exactly. Mm -hmm. Very, very healthy. Oh. No wonder. <laughs> In fact, that very is healthy. why she was not able to come last holiday. Exactly. Because she was preparing for her this exam. Exactly. exactly. <laughs> I can't wait for her to come home. I'm missing her. Uh, yeah, man, that's the enough. And the, uh, is the food ready? Almost So ready. that he can eat something before going. You know? See, my, my brother doesn't have anything. <laughs> no, so I'm I'm coming. Coming. Uh, yes. <laughs> look, look. Look, Azok, I will take a detachment of Levy, Army, and the Air Force to that school. It's so insane, the kind of things that come my way every day, every day. And then I try, I really try. I try, I really try. I try so hard to understand. So hard to understand. Maybe someday I will find a way somehow to figure it out. Figure it out. Figure it out. But how do I explain? How do I make you believe? You won't believe it. Yeah. 
Is this a dream I want to know? Is this a dream I want to know? Cause I want to wake from it someday. I don't know how it's so hard for me to even believe myself, believe myself, believe myself, yeah. And then I try, I really try, I try, I really try, I try so hard to understand, maybe someday I will find a way somehow. Figure it out, figure it out, figure it out. But how do I explain? How do I explain? How do I make you believe? How do I explain? How do I explain? You won't believe it. Good evening. Good evening. Good evening. Sarah. How are you? I'm fine. This, this, this side is fine like this. You let's say stay away. Yes. Mm. I sold everything and I made a lot of profit. Mm. Yes. Oh, yeah. Quick now, may you go bath. Food the cupboard. Okay. Mm. Thank you, ma. 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 Please. Don't be angry. Um, must you go out again tonight? I mean, I've made enough money for us to survive on at least for some days. How much did they do? 970. 970? Yes, almost a thousand naira. Ah, take five, take five. You try. You try. Thank really. you, ma. Uh -huh. But if I sleep here this night, I feel sick. I don't go see sleep, sleep. You see this hustle, it must continue. I don't go fit. If I sleep here this night, ah, I will say, for all a day, I need money. Eh? 970, you don't go get anywhere. Me and you need money. And now you need them pass. Very soon now, this picking that way you carry, you go burn them. You don't go feel pay anything for the picking where you carry so. You don't go even feel pay for hospital bill. So make a go and go hustle. Very soon now, you go just boom. Or we'll just they run up and down. Eh? Don't worry, you try. You try, baby. Nice and You try. Nice and You try. Nice and Nice and do for me. If I buy pad now, buy one eye pencil. Don't finish. Two days, yeah. In the name of Jesus, I cancel every evil activity against Auntie Sarah now. In the name of Jesus, I cancel it by the blood of Jesus. Cancel, 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 cancel in the name of Jesus. I cancel it in the name of Jesus. Oh Lord God, every demonic activity targeted against Auntie Sarah, oh Lord, this night I command it to be destroyed. I nullify it in the name of Jesus. Ah. 
customer. You good? Yeah. So uh, what's up? What's up for the night? Adeo. Hmm. I got my two guys with me. No, customer. I not go feed two na three na. No only one person I go feed. So I not go feed worker. What's your bill? What's your bill? Give me your bill. What's the price? Eh, if not only you are go feed collect fifty thousand. But I not feed two na three. No verse. Ndidi. Ndidi, welcome. Good morning. Thank you, God. Thank you, Jesus. Auntie Sarah, I'm so happy to see you. Welcome Thank back. You. Thank you. How are you? By the way, why you why you sleep for grand? Bed no no reach you. Auntie Sarah, I could not sleep most parts of the night. I was so worried because I had a terrible nightmare about you. The nightmare. Yes. I beg. What happened? It was terrifying. I was so afraid I had to kneel down and pray to God for your protection. Jesus. 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 If not, if you not see me here, I will not die since. Jesus God Christ. Save me. What happened? <laughs> I entered one chance last <gasps> night. No. Are you serious, Auntie Sarah? What happened? I don't know how I want. I don't know how I want to take that. If not, by now, we 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 have for don't day. Where for don't they? I would not just ask myself since morning. But Nana, I know say, God, they have them. Auntie hmm. Sarah, what happened? <laughs> Please tell me. <laughs> Some guys carried me last night. Huh? As this boy they carry me, I did inside. My body, they told me somehow. Ah, ah. So my body come to tell me, say, ah, Sarah, you don't enter one chance, so. Huh? Don't be smart in. All right, you know what? Get in the car. Let's see. Let's see. This is this is awful. Oh my god. So are you trying to say that all three of them no no go deal? If three of them hammer me, I not go survive them. If you see them, if you say they touch me, by now, <laughs> my bones everywhere for don't break finish. Don't be smart in, but then a miracle happened. What miracle? Hmm. As we just did, they struggle, they drag them, they drag them, you know me now? Thunder from nowhere, Bam! scatter! Thunder! If you see the way where I take, take off, my leg, can't they reach me from my head? Now God, mm. help me to thank God. Thank God. Mm. Thank God. Lord, I thank you. Thank you. It's God that saved you, and Sarah. If not be God, we are forty. We are friends with God. But Aunt Sarah, this should be a warning to you. Yes, it might be a cue that you should I stop. Beg you leave that thing. Listen to me. Leave that thing. I have to also. I need money. Eh? I've been told Don't worry. So many times. Oh, day. Then they protect you. Don't worry. Um, what's we'll we go chop this one? Don't say you get the letter. What's we'll you go chop? Me and Fee and. Nine, nine. I did not hear you were just saying it again. Who can you feel you could love? Our daughter is nowhere to be found. Which daughter? Do we have another daughter besides them, the Yamaka? They say she's missing. Nay, what are you talking? Nay, tell me you are joking. You people are joking. How can my daughter be missing? How? Well, I, I wish it was a joke. It's beginning to dawn on me gradually that our only surviving child may be gone forever. Nay, don't say that again. Don't just say that again. We sent our daughter to the boarding school to study and not to get missing. What are you talking? Now, if anything happens to my daughter, you and that school must provide, must produce my daughter. Uh, now, talk with me. 
Missing me. for what? Me. Get on me. If I make one on one, if I make one on one, Njini Aga, provide my daughter for me. Go and get my daughter. Chop one on one, get on one, baby. Missing for what? Chop one on one, Papa. There is a big problem. Madam, I think we made a mistake expelling them in the first place. What are you talking about, Mata? You know those girls deserve to be expelled. If their mother got pregnant, and she didn't even know who was responsible for her pregnancy, the other one. She took her to a quack doctor that performed an abortion that almost took her life. Fine, yes, they made a mistake. But we shouldn't have thrown the baby with the bath water. No. Maybe they do deserve a second chance. Mata, we need to find them. Bring them back at least to complete their education. Madam, I just hope we are not too late. Because I will not forgive myself if anything happens to any of them, especially in the Diamaka, the pregnant one. Madam, I will Be forgive myself. So Vera, I'm really scared for my life. I, I've been having nightmares and it, it's like I've been bewitched by that girl. What do you want me to do, Tessie? Please, I have problems of my own. Vera, I'm, I'm only telling you because I'm scared. You are the cause of your problems, Tessie. So deal with it yourself. How did I cause my own problems? Remember, we were all in this together. In fact, you were the one that said we should deal with Omar. Did I also ask you to go sleep with Mr. Sly? I didn't sleep with Mr. Sly. <laughs> okay, we were about to start before that witch came out from nowhere. The fact still remains that you went behind our back and decided to satisfy your selfish desires. Is that what you think? Yes. Then you're a fool. You're a very big fool. You're very stupid. Ah! I've been told so many times. There's more to life than what you see It's so insane The kind of things that come my way Every day Every day And then I try, I really try I try, I really try I try so hard to understand so hard to understand Maybe someday I will find a way somehow To figure it out Figure it out Figure it out But how do I explain How do I make you believe How do I explain A dream I wanna know. Is this a dream I wanna know? Cause I wanna wake from it someday. I wanna know. I don't know how. It's so hard for me to even believe myself. Believe myself. Believe myself. Yeah. And then I try. I really try. Mm, it's uh, in here. Yes, so thank God you got my message. Yes, so <sighs> I'm picking to find out. Um, 
too fun. Thank you. Okay, so I'll be in the reception, okay, in case you need anything. Ah, you try, wait, 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 wait. God bless you. Thank, Thank you. you. Ah, hello, Sissy. If you see your picking, picking where you born, you're picking too fine. Oh! Come be me like saying I'm born now. Picking too fine. Says the yellow. Yes. <laughs> too fine, I swear. He's very handsome. Yes, very, very handsome. You try away when I go bless you. Ah! What did happen again? Why you they cry? Instead of you to be happy, you they cry. What did make you they cry? You don't do now. No do a beg. Stop. Instead of you to be happy, if you see picking where you born, you're not going to be looking like you born now. No cry. Yeah. Did you make my daughter? Where are you? What happened to you? Are you dead or alive? I brought you up as a good girl. I find it difficult to believe the things they said you did in that school. How could you get pregnant? And worst of all, how could you not know who is responsible? And they said you even tried to kill yourself and your unborn child. I don't believe you are capable of all these things they said about you. Please come back home to me. Wherever you are, my daughter, come back so I can take care of you. Please, God, bring my only child back to me. Bring her back to me, oh God. Please bring her back to Watch me. My dear wife. You're crying again. Please wipe your tears. Eh? They will find in the Yamaka very soon. When, when, when will they find my daughter? When? Everybody's looking for her. The police, they are looking for her. Every, everybody is looking for her. See, and they said there has not been any report of a kidnapping or accident on the road since she and her friend left the school. So there's hope. There's hope. Uh, Nina, please wipe your tears. There's hope. Eh? Did they marker? Did they marker? My mind is telling me that my daughter is alive. My daughter is alive. Nothing will happen to my daughter. God, I know you will protect my daughter. Amen. I know you will protect my daughter. Amen. I know you will protect my daughter okay. for me. Okay. Oh, God, protect her for me. Let's go. Let's go. Let's go inside. Let's go. You can look at the back. Let's go. Protect my daughter. My daughter. And then I try, I really try. I try so hard to understand. So hard to understand. Maybe someday. I will find a way somehow to figure it out, figure it out, figure it out. Come. Now you sign this gate pass for me. Now, Madam Principal, sign them now. But you know, see our signature for there. You won't abuse me? I won't abuse you. Okay. This signature, eh? No be Madam Principality's signature be this. Hmm? Oh, I beg, I got I know well. I won't go buy medicine. I beg now, open the gates. <laughs> I be, you said don't get belly. She now you give him belly. I beg, open gates for us. We will not get time. Ah, <laughs> you don't know. I be sharp shooter. For say, they allow me to the browse or enter on a palace. All of them for don't get belly finish. Which kind of joke be that one?
So I found the bed this morning, doctor. The lady absconded, leaving a newborn baby behind. What nonsense! Are you trying to tell me she abandoned the child, a day old baby? That's what it looks like. We've searched everywhere in the premises, we couldn't find her. That ain't nonsense. Such things don't happen in this hospital. Get me the CSO and take care of that baby. Um, Jesse. I'm happy you're now back to your right senses. But I... I don't know why you allowed Vera and Oluchi to control you. I'm sorry about that. It's okay. Vera controls everyone like we are her slaves. It's okay. That's in the past now. Anyways, I'm happy you, you've agreed to dance to my tones now. So, it's now my duty to make sure your result comes out with distinction. <laughs> but, you must do me one favor. What is it? You remember that video you people recorded involving me and Vera? I want that video deleted. Yes. Because that is the only weapon Vera uses against me. And I don't like it. Alright, uh, I will see what I can do. Is that a promise? I trust you. Thank you, my love. <laughs> I'm ashamed of all of you, especially you, Mr. Ojo. Hmm? You have turned this noble institution into a place of harlotry. I'm shocked at Tessie's confession and everything we found out afterwards. I'm afraid we will not condone such behavior in this school. Oh. Please, Principal, please forgive me. Tamper justice with me, sir. I don't know what came over me. Stop it, Mr. Jones! The devil's work, you say. I think it's about time people learn to take responsibility for their mistakes and stop blaming the innocent devil. Sorry. Rubbish. No, I'm sorry, Ma. I made the mistake of associating with bad characters with Oluchi and Vera. What? Who are you calling bad characters? Are you not the one that went around sleeping with all the male teachers in this school? Eh? You even slept with Mr. Slide the day he vanished. Yes. She used to say she can't stay there without sex. Hey! Oh, Luchi and Vera, you both are liars. Please, ma, do not listen to them. Yes, even this morning, Mr. Andukwe slept with both of them at, 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 the, at the staff toilet just, just for him to pass them in English language. Will you shut up? All this is happening in my school. Okay. I think the best thing to do is hand you all over to the police. At least they could get some more confession from you. Please. <laughs> Meanwhile, it's my pleasure to let you know that you've all been expelled from school. Try. Mind the grey you, you leave Peking where you born. Peking where you so far carry for nine months. You don't make sense now. I had to do that. So that he will not suffer like me. You know our living condition, Auntie Sarah. How can I bring up a baby? In this situation, even at that, if 
for carry and go give your mama for village. Now they for take care of this speaking well. If you take care of him very well, you will try. You don't understand. My parents are very, very poor. They can barely take care of themselves. I couldn't have added another burden to their already difficult lives. You don't do no crime. No crime. No crime. Go deep. Uh, good afternoon. Please, I'm looking for my friend. She stays around here. Wait, now you build you. We don't they wait for you, Tete now. Maybe today we don't expect you. My name is Nasera. Indeed, they stay with me. Oh, to Sarah. <laughs> Indeed, you told me so much about you. She said oh. you've been so good to her. Thank you so much. You're welcome. <laughs> she don't tell me plenty good things about you. She tell me everything will happen. Don't worry. That could go reward you. Oh, man. Please, where is she? I've really missed her. Make a call for you. Ndidi! 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 I better come, person, they find you. Oh, oh my God! Oh, 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 oh my bestie! Is this you? Look at you! Oh my God, it's good to see you. Oh my God, wow. Didi, wow, after all you've been through, you still look pretty. My dear friend, it's the lost doing. You know God never forsakes his own. I know. It's good to see you. <laughs> it's been like forever. Yes. Come on, tell me see everything. See your makeup, see your makeup, see your hair. Oh, so how many things to talk about? Let's go back. Was I the person that mentioned your name in the first place? Was I the person that mentioned your name in the principal's office? Or did I send you to twang your students in the toilet? Leave me alone, oh. Leave me alone. Let me go. Let me leave this school in peace. Ojo! Ojo, Menjo! Are you not the one that taught me how to rob, handle the students in the toilet? Are you not the one? Chimo. Are you not the one? Ndukwe, I taught you how to use students in the toilet. Yes? But did I force you? Ndukwe, did I force you to do it? You abused it. You are doing it in the morning. You are doing it in the afternoon. You are doing it in the evening. Even miss lectures because of the toilet. Oh, Honestly speaking, Ojo Menjo, you, I regret knowing someone like you. You are a bad person and a bad influence. Look where you are a devil. You are a devil, idiot. I will forget. You are an ingrate. Honestly, you are even lucky. You are even lucky I did not inform the police about your sexual scandal. Hey! Yes, by now! You could have been inside the cell Chuku. and it think is done away! Chuku, Chuku, Ebe, 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 Chuku. Ojo Amenjo. If you had mentioned my name at the police station, I would have told them a lot of things they didn't even know about you. A lot of unpleasant things you were doing in this school. Hey, Look at this man. Hey, hey, hey. By now, they would have locked you there and thrown the key in the, in, in the lagoon. <laughs> Look at this man. Oh, oh. <laughs> Thank God he did not say anything, no. Because there are some other stories that did not come out about you. I could have unleashed it by now. By now. Look at, look at, look at this idiot. How were you even doing it in the toilet that you want to eat it with your walking stick? How were you doing it? 
Look at if, even that tiny toilet. How are, are you doing with the old, am, old man? I am a police rider. Look at are you jealous? Are you jealous? Are you jealous? So, why are you calling me? I'll get the camera. Go get the camera. Go get the camera. I can't believe you actually did that. How could you? I couldn't take care of a baby. I mean, I can't even take care of myself. Would you? I can't give the baby the proper care he needs to grow up. I just believe he's better off there. And I thought I was going to be an aunt when you told me you've put to bed. I can't imagine the agony I went through to take that decision. But I did it for the baby's sake and for mine. Okay. I understand. Thank you. <laughs> Cheer up. <laughs> <sighs> well, now that you're free again, we need to register for GCE. The forms are out for sale. We need to get them right now. I know, but I have no money. Don't worry. I'm here to assist you. I'm going to assist you every step of the way. Don't worry. <laughs> I'm here now. Okay. <laughs> I know you've missed me. This is the newspaper publication of uh, the Damaka and her friend Odenu Junwa that uh, they are looking for. Uh, we are sure they will find them. Yeah, they better find them quickly. I want to see my daughter. <laughs> uh, brother, don't worry. With this newspaper publication and uh, coupled with all the radio and television announcements they have been making, they will be found. Everybody is on the lookout for them. And the principal has promised a handsome reward for anybody that finds them. I'm afraid, though. I'm afraid. The city is not a place a young girl should be roaming about. Eh? And ask not the email. Why? Why the email? Hey! Uh, let us not lose hope. Eh? Let us be optimistic. So It's been like one year since you came into my house. You decided to. Remain in Abuja and enjoy your father's share of the national cake. National cake? <laughs> Which national cake? Man, I make my own money. I don't really? depend on my dad for anything. I got my own hustle. <laughs> I'm a hustler, baby. That's a spirit, bro. That's by the a way, spirit. By the way, <laughs> good wine. Really good wine. Yeah. Where'd you get this stuff from, by the way? And it's expensive, huh? You have forgotten? My father is a sole exporter. Ah, uh, yes. Yes, yes, that makes a lot of sense. <laughs> so now you're saving your father's fortune, huh? Mm. I see, I see. Which reminds me, oh, that this whole thing was flowing that day those school girls came around, man. You bad boy. <laughs> <laughs> Henry, you still remember that crazy night? Wow. I can never forget that crazy night. The schoolgirls were amazing. <laughs> and you bad boys dealt with them seriously, huh? Those girls are naughty girls. Very naughty. Although your girl was the prettiest and of course the loveliest. But she... She was naive. And did you have what? Indidi Amaka. That's her name. Oh. Lovely girl. I can never forget her. 
I wish I could see her again. Well, Henry, you have to forget about them, you know. We've grown past that level now. Yeah. I can never forget Nidhi. Never. That girl made me fall in love in the single night that we spent together. Mm. I'm telling you. <laughs> My friend is in love. <laughs> well, the question is, do you know where she is? Do you even have a contact? I wish. I wish. But I know. I know that faith will make our paths cross. So many times. I know. Faith. You cannot really lie There's on more that. To life than what you see. <laughs> So you say the kind of things that come my way every day. Every day. As you say, this is more than the jackpot. Believe it. God has finally answered our prayers. Yes. We've been admitted with full scholarship to study. For now. Ah, you know he's uh, so last last while they go university. Yes. Now Jim, go to be this. Yes, it, it, it's a dream come true. It's everything I've always wanted. I've always wished and prayed for, and now and it's finally coming to pass. I can't believe it. Man, Dubem, 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 where my money? Where my money, Dubem? Which money are you talking about? Money where I keep, where I want to cook soup, soup where we go chop. Where is your mouth go sit chop? I beg, Joe, go find your money where you keep them. What is your problem? Dubem, why they do me like this? Why they do me this kind thing? I go come out, small money where I go get. You go carry the money, take drink. Take the smoke! Which money? Mm. Eh? I bet. Come on, Joe. Come on, Joe. What do you you? You know, you know they go anywhere. You know they go anywhere today. You go keep me for inside the house. Is this a dream? <laughs> come on, come on, come on, buy your money. Is this a dream I wanna know? Cause I wanna wake from it someday. I wanna know. I don't know how. It's so hard for me to eat. Joe, what are we going to eat today? I don't know. We don't even have enough cash. Mm. Okay, you see, you know that okra, that okra soup. We can even buy more fresh okra and then we'll add it. They will now put some maggi. <laughs> so like to be fresh. <laughs> you know, Auntie Sarah says she will send us money on Friday. At least let's manage till then. You understand? Didi, I'm thinking we should get a job after this our semester exam so that we can earn our own money instead of always depending on Auntie Sarah to send us some cash. Eee, that's true. It's a good idea. Seriously, that's a good idea. Because if we have our own money, we can at least be helping ourselves. Auntie Sarah has tried too much. Oh. Let's not overburden her. Uh, will she come and die for us? It's true. Anyway, let me watch the market, okay? Please, don't be long. I'm very hungry. Whatever. <laughs> and don't go and be following boys. Oh, please. It's been four whole years now since my only child and daughter did it disappeared without a trace, leaving me empty-handed in my old age. Why is life so cruel to me? I have had five other children who did not live beyond their first year. The only one that survived was also taken away from me in mysterious circumstances. <laughs> Why is my destiny so unfair? Why? Oh, no way, yeah. 
I believe they've gone through so much pain, not knowing where I am or what has become of me. Maybe this is the right time to see them. No, 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 no. They must not see me until I've fulfilled my ambition of becoming a university graduate. At least that way, they can easily forgive me of all the pain and shame I've caused them. My own parents have given up hope of ever seeing me again. It would be such a pleasant surprise to go home in a few weeks as a graduate. That's the kind of surprise I want to give my parents. Like a daughter whom they think is long dead and then I suddenly reappear as a university graduate. You know. <laughs> Can you imagine? <laughs> I can't wait. That would be the happiest moment of my life. <laughs> Indeed. Uju, God has really turned everything that went wrong in our lives into glorious testimonies. I know. To him, all glory and honor be given. Amen. <laughs> Fried rice and chicken. Fried rice and chicken? Yes. Excuse me. Please, can I have. Uh... Your name is Nidiamaka, right? Um, sorry. Who are you? Look at the face properly. Don't you, don't you remember me? We, we met many years ago at a party in the night. It's me, Henry. Henry! Henry! Yeah, you. Yeah! yeah. Henry. Oh my god! Oh my god, oh my god. look at you! Sorry, Henry, forgive me, please. This is Uju. Uju, my friend. Hi. Pleasure to meet you, nice H Henry. Henry. And Auntie Sarah, my auntie. Pleasure to meet you. I'm so Wow. Um, Uju and Auntie Sarah, this is my friend, Henry. Henry and I met one fateful night. Yeah. A long time ago. Long, long time ago. Yeah, long time ago. <laughs> ah ah. Kenzi, what did they happen here? You can't say you won't come out. Yes. Eh? Mm. You and this your Henry boy. You be like, say, Henry done the trick for you. Seriously. Me, I know. <laughs> Are you not the first small small? <laughs> oh, Auntie Sarah, you are just impossible. Mm. Look, Henry and I are just friends. There's nothing going on between us. My lie. See, love. I said, they look you. Now, so, so love, I receive for your face. Me, I know now. I'd be expert for that department. <laughs> I don't go, dear, come out. And every now. Betty, you want to tell me, I know. <laughs> no, no, no. I, seriously, there is nothing going on between us. Mm. Henry comes from a very wealthy family. Okay. I mean, what can he possibly want to do with a church rat like me? Everything, no. Uh, everything. See, me, I tell you. When a man, they love the woman. You <laughs> get 
Wait till you they talk when they enter your head. Everywhere go block. I will tell you now. I will not go to your come out. I know everything now. Mm. Uh, see you. I want tonight to be special for us. Speaking about night, <laughs> I remember the first time we met. Almost ended up in a fiasco. That's because. I was still a naive schoolgirl and yeah. I wasn't too pleased by the whole deceptive setup. Yeah, I remember. I'm sorry about that. That's okay. And I'm sorry about everything else. <laughs> but ever since I laid my eyes on you that night, I never stopped loving you. Henry, what are you saying? I'm saying that fate brought us together and it wasn't clear until that night and I love you from the bottom of my heart, from the very depths of my heart and I wish we could spend our lives together. And then I try, I really try. I try, I really try. I try so hard to understand. My entity, Ndidi Amaka, my one and only. Please marry me. Say yes. Henry, are you serious? I've never been more serious in my entire life. Ndidi. Yes, Mama. Mama, I am not a ghost. Ndidi. Ndidi. Mama, I am not a ghost. I am your daughter. Ndidi. Yamaka. Ndidi. Mama, it's me. Ndidi. Ndidi, Mama. Ndidi. 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 Mama. Nani? Mama. Nani? Mwa beze. Ndidi, Mama. Ndidi, give it didn't get it. No way. Didn't Azuka. 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 Maybe someday I will find a way somehow to figure it out. Figure it out. Eh? Did you make a So I am seeing you in flesh and blood. Yes, Mama. Did you? Did you make Where have you been? Mama, it's a long story. Cut it short. Oh my God! I wish I could. 
Hey. Mom, I'm just happy that I'm seeing you and Papa and Uncle Azuka. You are all alive and well. Thank hey. God. This is a wonderful day in my life. Eh? My little daughter that I thought was dead, mm -hmm. she mm. has come back to me a big woman. Mm. Hey. <laughs> Our ancestors be praised. Hey. Thank God. Holy oh. sir. Hmm. Ah. Jesus. Um, young man. Sir. What is your name? Uh, thank you very much, sir. My name is Henry Okemwa. Henry Okemwa. Uh, hmm. Sorry, please. I'm very sorry that I did not introduce him. Uh, Uncle Azuka, Mama, Papa. This is Henry, the only son of Senator Okemwa. And he wants to marry me. Eh? He wants to marry you? Yes, Mama. Oche, Henry? Yes, Mama. This is a big story. You look good, man. You're hey, welcome, my son. Thank you very much. Yeah. Uh, no, no, I should be thanking you for bringing back my daughter. Uh, I hereby approve of anything you want to do. Oh, Zimba, 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 uh -huh. He's a very big uh, politician and a uh, uh, business mogul. Hey. 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 A very big businessman. Hey. Look, I am happy you want to marry my niece. Hey, in that case, welcome. you're very welcome. You're welcome. Thank you, you're welcome. You, Thank you so much. No, no. Thank you, Papa. Thank you, sir. Did you My daughter. Did you have a daughter? Thank you. Thank you. Thank you. No, no. no. You brought him. Thank you. See as I'm happy for you, he be me make I cry. See as God take repair everything where we don't spoil for your life. Eh? I never thought it would be that easy for my parents to forgive and accept me back. Most will give their approval for Henry and I to get married. How? Indeed. The Lord has been so good to all of us. Yes, so. Virtually all our expectations have been met and all we lost restored. What is even more surprising to me is that Henry's father did not despise my humble background, but he wholeheartedly accepted me to marry his son. See you! <laughs> see you! Who go see fine girl like you? We get better character. Hold down. We no go green make you say, Mariam. <laughs> Tell me. Oh, no. hmm. You don't say you be fine girl. <laughs> no talk me again, no. In Papa no get choice. Yes, no, I no get choice. Well, Auntie Sarah, with you my best friend, these testimonies would not have been possible if both of you did not stand firm to support and encourage me throughout the hard times of my life. I'm so grateful. <sighs> no talk me again. Now you encourage me, pass. The minutes where your legs step inside this is my house, nine good things start to happen for my life. I don't go lie for you. If not be you, we are life for day. We are life for day. And I'm happy pass so. <laughs> well, the good news is both of you will not suffer again like we did. Because Henry has promised that after our wedding next month, he's going to rent decent apartments for both of you. No, 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 Yes, and also he's going to give you jobs at his father's company. Oh, oh, no. Yes, this one suits me oh. for my whole life. Oh. And the best news we don't they hear. Yes, I'm happy. Yes. Oh, God bless oh, him. You see, you're Henry. Amen. Who get blessed sooner? Amen. You see this marriage? You go born gay. You go born born gay. Amen. You see this marriage? Who go blessed sooner? Amen. Who go bless your everything? And I don't better my life. Who go better my life? You're my best friend. <laughs> Thank you. Thank you. You're your best friend. <laughs> allow me. Allow me to enjoy my best teacher. I'm happy for you. Hey! Vera? Is this Vera? 
Farah, is this you? Oh my god. What's going on? Why are you looking like this and what are you doing here? It's a long story. Please, please, let's go. Please, please, drive. Let's leave this place. Would you? I want to hear the story. Farah, what happened I to you? I don't care about our story. Would you relax? Relax, please. Would you please forgive me? Forgive me, please. I know that back in school, my friends and I made life miserable for you girls. I'm really sorry. I regret every single thing I did to you girls. Please forgive me. Would you? Would you? Look, let's just forgive her, okay? Let's give her another chance. Even God, our Father in Heaven, has forgiven us and given us a new chance. Let's do the same for our sister. Would you please? I'm sorry. Please. Vera, don't worry. We're going to help you, okay? Don't worry, don't worry. I can't believe this. Would you please? A party? What kind of party is it? And what has that got to do with me? Indeed. It's a party of some important people in town. We were lucky enough to be invited as ushers, and they will pay us good money. I've never been to a party before. Why me? Why not? You're a very beautiful and intelligent girl. Don't worry, we'll teach you all you need to know before tomorrow night, okay? Yes, indeed. We'll also be taking care of everything we'll be wearing to the party. I assure you, there will be no problem whatsoever. And besides, Ndidi, you need the money to take care of some of your needs here in school. You cannot always rely on your parents. You know that, right? Who be that? Where are they go? Rakit is now in now. Eh? Now, now your babes. So. We just see Moldos, Moldos come out, enter town small. We'll soon come back. Ha! <laughs> Maybe we'll just come out small, enter town. Abi, when I don't forget, say, now the same blood where they on a body, now they my body. Oh, God, Cletus. But we usually say to you whenever we go out now. Ah, uh, are you out of your mind? Go back to where? You girls deceived me. You told me we were coming for an ushering job. No, no, it was a big fat lie. If I knew it was this sort of arrangement, I wouldn't have followed you here. You are not even happy that we are exposing you to a civilized way of I life. I don't want it. I don't like it. First of all, would you? Mm. Yes, you. Get lost. We need to speak to her alone. Now! You need to learn how to talk to people politely. Rephrase your words. <laughs> if I slap if you, you what? Would you? Hey. If you what? You think I'm afraid of you girls? Listen, I know what you girls do. And if you mess with me, your secret will be blown to the entire school. Oh. <laughs> would, you, would you please listen? Let's not cause any trouble this afternoon. Just excuse us for a moment, please. Just a minute. Yes! Biko! Move! Vanish! Shoo, 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 shoo. Ah! Get out! To your bed! On my way down here, guess who I bumped into? Who? Oh. The principal? No. It's that Oversabi mass teacher. Do you mean Miss Martha? Yes. She stopped me and started asking me some silly questions. <sighs> Life has taught me a bitter lesson today. <laughs> I have just realized how terribly I messed up my life. Look at Ndidi and Uju. They are now graduates and also doing very well. While all the three of us that persecuted and tried to mislead them back in school, we have become useless. <laughs> useless to ourselves and our respective families. Tessie works as a cleaner in a public toilet. 
oluchi, fries akara, and also hawks oranges on the streets. And look at this place that I am managing. Ah, oh God. What have we done to ourselves? What have we done? <laughs> so going out with them one night with the pretext that we were going for a party. I didn't know that they had planned for a group sex party with, with some men. What? They... <laughs> Did you... <laughs> what? They forced me to sleep with the five men that night. <laughs> them one night with the pretext that we were going for a party. I didn't know that they had planned for a group sex party with, with some men. What? They... <laughs> Did you... <laughs> what? They forced me to sleep with the five men that night. <laughs> Could you... I'm so sorry. <laughs> <laughs> It's okay, it's okay, it's okay, it's okay, it's okay. It's okay, listen, listen, listen. Let's just forget about everything, okay? Just leave everything behind us. Look at Vera, look what she's going through, look. You don't understand. I was in pain for several days, and two weeks later, I found out that I was pregnant. You need to be to the doctor, the quack doctor, who successfully aborted it. It was it's horrible. It was horrible. It was it's the worst okay. thing. Okay. It's okay. It's okay. It's okay. Come on. Come on. Hey. Hey. What are you doing there? Well, I should be asking why do you look so sexy and so beautiful? The girls that all the boys want, and she's all mine. Hmm? I've waited for this my entire life to make you my wife. And I promise you will never regret it. I love you. I love you too. You've been acting strange these few days. Don't tell me nothing. Because I'm no longer comfortable with it. What's what's going on? Hey, talk to me. What's this? Hate me. I'm sorry. What are you sorry for? What what happened? What did you do? I know you love me. But I've let you down as a woman. You didn't, you didn't let me down. You, you haven't let me down as a woman, babe. Hey. Yes, I have. What, what are you talking about? I heard you talking with your father on the phone last night. I know he's complaining about we not having any child since our two years of marriage. Henry, <laughs> please, I'm sorry. No, 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 come on. About that, don't worry, I'm not complaining. 
No one is complaining, all right? It's fine. Come on, is that, is that why you're so upset? No I one... got pregnant when I was in school and I got expelled for it. I didn't know what happened to me. You... I didn't know who got me pregnant because I never had an affair with any man. I just didn't know. You got pregnant? Yes. <laughs> was it that night at Emeka's place when you came with Vera and your friends? Was it? It was after. I found out about two months after. Stayed away from your parents all this while? Yes. Oh my god. My friend took me to a doctor for an abortion. We didn't know the doctor was a quack one. Oh my god. I almost lost my life during the process. And then I got expelled. We both got expelled. <laughs> That's how we came to the city. <laughs> and then I met Auntie Sarah, who helped me until I was delivered of a baby boy. <laughs> you, you, you have a son? There's nothing you should be sorry about because I'm the one that I'm the one at fault. Everything that happened to you is my fault. And I need you to promise me that you will forgive me for everything. Promise me that you will forgive me. I love you so much. I can forgive you anything. I just want you to forgive me. There's nothing to forgive because it's all my fault. I was so stupid. I was young. I was selfish. That night, at the Mecca's house. That night. I did something to you. And I am so ashamed of myself right now. Oh boy, where are you this since now? I don't want to look for you. What is it? Hmm. And I need a favor. Okay. What is it? She's still proving hard to get? I see. She said she doesn't take alcohol. She wants something light. But you get anything where you can forgive her. That's a small case. Oh! There you go. Nice one, man. Nice one. What do you want? Chop knuckles. Nice one. Henry. Yeah? Go out there and have fun like everyone else is. Fun? <laughs> Bros, I don't think there's any fun with that girl. She has refused to go upstairs. Vehemently refused to go upstairs. Look, Harry. 
That girl is a small girl. And she's equally naive. Just persuade her some more and <laughs> she'll fall. So if she decides not to go upstairs and persist, I should I should force her. I mean what can I do? Okay, listen. All girls are the same. At first they try to prove how to get. But with your consistent persuasion, you know, they'll fall in line. But in case she keeps proving stubborn, then we have to try it in second method. Second method? What, what second method? What am I talking about? Yan Mina, what's, what's the secret? That's great. Oh, yes. Well, Henry, the question is this. Do you still want to get laid tonight? <laughs> Bros, you did ask. Of course I want to get laid. See those banging chicks outside, man. Why are we here? <laughs> Take this. Take it. Just one tablet in her drinker. It's done. I've been told so many times. Hey, Mecca. What, what is this and what does it do? Then we stop asking so many questions. Just one tablet, not more than one. Just one tablet. And don't forget Vera is waiting for me upstairs. I have a lot of work to do tonight. Every day. Every day. And then I try, I really try. I try, I really try. I try so hard to understand. So hard to understand. Maybe someday. I will find a way somehow to figure it out, figure it out, figure it out. But how do I explain? How do I make Did he? Hey. How do I hey. Okay. Yeah. Okay. See. <laughs> uh. Is this a dream I want to know? Is this a dream I want to know? Because I want to wake from it someday. I want to know. I don't know how. It's so hard for me to even believe myself, believe myself, believe myself. Yeah. And then I try, I really try. I try, I really try. I try so hard to understand. Maybe someday I will find a way somehow to figure it out. Figure Figure it out. But how do I explain? How do I explain? How do I make you? That's how I drugged you and took you upstairs. You were unconscious. But you were still so beautiful. And you're still very beautiful. But I couldn't resist. I couldn't resist and I proceeded to make love to you and what I realized you were a virgin but it was already too late what? you can imagine the relief I had when you woke up and didn't remember a single thing that happened the night before I thought that was all I never knew you were pregnant I never knew you were going to have a son I'm so sorry. I swear I love you. And not a day goes by that I don't think about you. Henry. Oh my God, no. 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 No, Henry. I can't believe you did this to me. 
So you were the cause of everything that I suffered all those years. Harry. Harry. I could have lost my life. How could it be so wicked? How could you? God, I hate you. You're right. You have every right to hate me, but I beg you. I beg you. With all the sincerity of the love I have for you now, please forgive me. Please forgive me because I don't know what I would do to myself. If you leave, please forgive me. You promised. Please. Don't. Just stay away from me. Please. Stay away from me. Didi, please. I just. I was stupid, but everything happens for a reason. I beg you. Please. Just. 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 Let, let's just let it go. Please. Indidi. I've been told so many times. There's more to life than what you see. It's so insane, the kind of things that come my way Every day, every day It's okay, Indy. Please forgive him. Come on, look on the bright side. Everything turned out well at the end. Maybe this is the only way fit just to bring the both of you together. Hmm? I beg. Forgive her, my own husband. I use God beg you. Indeed. Please forgive me. Please forgive me. Let this go. I confessed. And you promised to forgive me. Let this go. You're holding on to this more than I expected. Longer than I expected. I found our son. Huh? You found our son? Yes, I know where he lives. And through the help of the hospital where you gave birth, I found him. I confessed to my dad. He said he was going to use his connection to help us get him back. So they're going to give us our son? Yes, we started the process, but it needs you, his mother, to make it happen. Just take me to my son right now. Take me to my son, please. First, I need you to forgive me. I need you to let this go. Just let it go. Please forgive me. Please. Please. Because <laughs> you should see our son. He's, he's so handsome. He's, he's a handsome, talented young man. You should see him. And I want us to give him the love that we have denied him from day one. But I need you to forgive me, to let let this go. Just, just, just let it go. Just let it go, please. I know I hurt you. Please forgive me. I forgive you. <laughs> That's nice. Are you sure? From the bottom of my heart. Oh. I've been so Are you sure? <laughs> Please take me to my son. I will. And I promise you, my love, my queen, my angel, that from henceforth, and your friends and God is my witness that I will never make you shed a tear again. And I will love you and my son to the very last moment on earth. And then I try, I really try. I try, I really try. I try so hard to understand. So hard to understand. Maybe someday I will find a way somehow to figure it out. Figure it out. Figure it out. But how do I explain?
Is this a dream I wanna know? Is this a dream I wanna know? Cause I wanna wake from it someday. I wanna know. I don't know how. It's so hard for me to even believe myself. Believe myself. Believe myself.